Listen, there is a peak, a frozen peak to the north. <gasps> Sounds cold and bad. It is a bastion of great beauty and power. <gasps> All right, fine, I'll go, but I'm going to complain the whole time. Guys, this is... It's a big dragon. What? There's a dragon at the top. Listen, the, um, at the top, we've got to be careful not to wake it. You start to proceed upwards. If yeah, there's going to yeah, be a great yeah, evil yeah. on this mountain, it's going to be me. Yeah. <laughs> you finish that sentence that and pull yourself up like a rocky incline, and you come face to face with a sort of a very long beaked nose oh. and pointed ears and a domed skull with oh. a pointy little chin with lots of little teeth. It pauses and like cocks ahead as you hear sort of this big woof noise from up the mountain. Oh. And there is a small avalanche of snow that has just oh. been disturbed. It goes, Dang. And it, it pauses, it's like Sounds like the dragon. <laughs> the the sound dissipates and it kind of refocuses its attention on you. Prince. And I would like you to roll for initiative. Yeah. <laughs> Can so I see a picture? Stab it through the face. Yeah, of course you can. It's, it's an ugly thing. It's like a gargoyle <laughs> picture. Nat you... 20, baby. Crit, 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 crit for Corazon. Crit, And a... Oh, that is a seven. So, <laughs> okay. not quite as good. Corazon, has he, has he um, reached the ledge yet? Is he still dangling? Yes, I think, okay, all right. yeah. We can say that. All right. Oh, Hoist boy. yourself over that ledge. So I can have advantage on your first attack because of your lovely, lovely crit. Oh, I got advantage. Well then. What are you gonna do? <laughs> Someone's getting sneak attacked because I need to have advantage to use it. So in your face, mm -hmm. stupid mm -hmm. ice pterodactyl. So I'm gonna attack it with my rapier, mm -hmm. which is uh, 1d8. So mm -hmm. let me just pull out d8. A simple case. <laughs> simple yep. case I mean, counting the sides. You'll need that <laughs> if, if you've hit it. You need to roll for the attack. Oh, do I? Right. Yeah. You're looking to beat an armor class of 11. Hit that method. Uh, it's 13. Great. You have done it. All right. Uh, now roll your damage. All right. You simply count half the size. Oh my god, that's a one. But, 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 sneak attack. Come on, sneak attack. 2d6. That's a six. Yes. And a four. So that's 11. 10. 11, yeah. Nice. Really? Wow, okay. Uh, yeah, you, you you deal a good chunk of damage. Um, yeah. Uh, it sort of grips the blade and looks at it as like... And like some ichor starts to sort of bubble up yeah, in its throat. Um, and it sort of... It's been impaled by you, but it's furious. I was going to imagine. Absolutely livid. All right, I would like to use my bonus action to... Mm. Uh, to hide. Oh, wait, you can't <laughs> Okay, so you take the sword out of the method, I assume. Does it come out? Can I get it out? I mean, you, I guess you could leave it in if you want to. Mm, no, I, I probably should hang on to it. Okay, fine. Uh, that is absolutely fine. I sweep a load of snow over myself. <laughs> Where did Corazon go? <laughs> Corazon? <laughs> Corazon? There is no time for you to try and spot Corazon because the ice method so if it does a leap with a, a big woof of its wings, mm, 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 mm. and as it kind of comes down, it attempts to slash you with Ooh. its icy, icy claws. Oh, What's your AC? No. Uh, sorry, my AC is 12. Okay. Ah, it misses. Um, it kind Ooh. of, you sort of duck, and you feel the icy wind kind of Close one. over your head. Mm. Um, you see it kind of mumble, it's like blah, 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 blah. blah. And this like fog just comes pouring up the mountain. Oh! Like you know when it normally pours out of chest. Yeah. It's not meant to do the other bit, but it goes. Okay. And suddenly you're all wreathed in oh, fog. Oh no! Cool. My dark vision won't help against a mist at no, all. So you're going to be at disadvantage. Cool. Traditionally, I would go for a good eldritch blast here, but I'm concerned about using a spell that might bring the mountain down on top of us because, as we just said, there's uh, you know an avalanche impending. Yeah. Mm. So I'm going to take one of my. I'm going to take a stiletto knife. <laughs> Ooh. And I'm going to yeah. slash at its wing. So I'm going to try and get a wing off it. We're up, <laughs> we're up really high, and if I can just rip one of its wings off, and, eventually, and we can boot it off the cliff, yeah. and then it will fall to its frozen death. I love it, I shout from under my little pile of snow. But quietly, though. <laughs> yeah, quietly. <Ooh. laughs> yeah. Okay. okay, so I, need qu to... I quietly I'm like... lunge for one of its wings with a stiletto blade. You need to beat an 11, but you're at disadvantage, so roll a d20 twice and take the worst result. Okay, Sorry. all right, two good rolls, please. Okay, that's a 13. That's good, decent start. And the second is at 10. Oh. No. 
Uh, but but you're you using not... a weapon you have proficiency in, right? I mean, uh, yeah, yeah. I believe so. You but does that... You... Yeah, yeah, yeah. You add your proficiency Oh, points. okay, so I use weapons so infrequently. <laughs> <laughs> this, yeah, this is the first time you've actually so used that's... a blade on something. Uh, no, you stabbed no I, stabbed, I stabbed a of goblin one time. <laughs> I stabbed a, po- a pirate another time. Anyway, so that, that makes it 16 and a 13. Great. Uh, in mm. that case, could you please roll damage? So that is a stiletto knife. It's 1d3 piercing. So yeah, roll the d6 and then we'll halve the damage. Okay, all right, there we go. All right. Now I see why you don't use these. Yeah. I know, actually. It's a bit... uh, that's a six. Yeah, okay, so it's, a it six. takes three, three damage. Three damage in its wing. Okay, cool. Just a little hole, because a stiletto is sort of a, a pokey pokey knife. <laughs> well, it's, it's, so it's puncturing. It's kind of... Piercing. Ordinarily, you, it, yeah. you know, you think it would just kind of just give it a puncture, but you actually the sort of handguard of it ends up just making a tear, uh. and you put a big slit in uh. one of its wings, and it kind of like hisses okay. and recoils and spins, <gasps> okay. and it's sort of just like holding on to it. It's okay. just like, ah, it's work with that. It looks furious, <laughs> absolutely livid. Such can, an angry method. Can three of us hear any of this? Or are we too far away? Um. I think you're too far away. They're Maybe. all trying to be quiet, aren't they? So. Yeah. yeah. We probably. heard the avalanche. We're like... Yeah. It's like, yeah, you, you heard the sort of snow coming down. So you could conceivably be like, let's go have a look over there. Let's go meet up with the others. Yeah, let's go towards that avalanche sound. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> Charge okay. towards the avalanche. That's dub. Be really, okay, we'll be really Corazon. careful. Very yeah. It's Mephit. I, I think I just made it madder. Okay. Uh, but its wing's a bit damaged. All right, so, cool. So um, we'll see what you can do with that. Do I, do I, I have disadvantage? Also, it's misty. Oh, and the fog. Yes, you're still in the cloud. Right. Um, okay. So, what's the fact that I should have advantage because I'm hidden cancel out the disadvantage? Yeah, I imagine so. Yeah. Okay. Mm-hmm. Sod it, why not? All right. Well, I'm going gonna, gonna to pop out of hiding mm-hmm. and give him another jam with the rapier. Yep. Get that in there. Just if I can get through the top of the head, through <laughs> all of the, <laughs> the major. Out. Bring them all out like a shish Yeah, yeah. Exactly. Do it. All right. That is. Uh, 13. You've hit. So initial damage is 8, and then 1 and 2, so 11. Yep, okay. Um, you do indeed manage to skewer the effort. It kind of like... <laughs> um, how close are you to Corazon, Prudence? Um, I had to stab the Mephit, and I didn't really withdraw after that, so maybe like a couple of feet away. Great, yeah. okay. Um, sort of, you see, like, the light starts to go out in this Mephit's eyes, ah. but just before it dies, Love you it. see it kind of like, it starts to pull its face up into, a, like, a grin, and it explodes <laughs> in a shard of, like, a, a burst of jagged ice. Yeah. I'd like both of you to make me a dexterity saving throw right oh. now, please. Oh, dexterity, oh, I'm not very dexterous. Uh, that's eight. <laughs> mm-hmm. And that's a six. Okay, uh, neither of you manages to dodge. You take four points of slashing damage. Oh, Ooh, ice so everywhere. It, it, and it's, ice. It is that kind of cut you get from Ooh. ice where you're like, ah, that stings as well as it cuts. Ah, ah, and cold. Ow. Um, you definitely hear the, sp- it sounds like a, a glass is broken. You see this, pssst, and then you just hear like, ah. <laughs> Coming from over the way. I hate methods. Ah, uh, methods are the worst. All right, uh, let's not disturb any more methods. Let's run towards the sound of the, yeah. sound, the sound of the the sound of the sound. Yeah. You <laughs> meet up with them while well, they are still going. Uh, I see the remains of the uh, method. Nothing. No. Oh. <laughs> And what creature needs my Nothing. help? <laughs> <laughs> Don't heal this thing. I cast cure wounds on the corpse. <laughs> we beat it easily. Yeah, this I uh, this blood I put it there myself. Nice. Yeah, to look cool Perfect. and dangerous. Well, what uh, have you been up to? Yeah, we um, wolf. We oh met, yeah. yeah. What was his name? How did Remus. he? We're us? not telling you. Oh. Remus. <laughs> Remus had one. Bear and now. Bear. They, they, as long as this is within the group and they're trusted friends. This How did the secrets. fight with the wolf go? Yeah. Did you kill it? Uh, we, what, Let's we, say yes. We helped it. We There's didn't have someone, a fight. It was stuck in a trap and we freed it. Someone's left traps everywhere. Oh, and it, it that really was embarrassing for Remus. No, yeah. it's not embarrassing. It can happen to a lot of animals. Man, I should tell everyone about what happened to Remus. Meryl, <laughs> eh? <laughs> We had one job. Raven. Oh, <laughs> <all right on. laughs> this business, notorious coward has been brought Raven. <laughs> in absence of us ever saying it, I assume that she's still strapped she's to She's sherpering our gear. Yeah, yeah. She, oh, yeah. She, yeah. She's sherpering the gear, but Egbert's mm. sherpering business. Aww. She she pulls a, a raven out from inside her coat, strangely. <laughs> and it's like. <laughs> um, 
and it takes the piece of paper and it spread this tale far, far and wide. The tale of Remus. Somewhere else in Geth, an estate agent a gets, a, gets a note <laughs> saying Remus the wolf <laughs> got trapped in a trap. Ha oh, ha ha. Man. That'll explain why the house isn't selling. Okay, all right. Um, Egbert, <sighs> yes. Should we heal up these ice? I suppose. Stands? Yeah. Why not? What do you mean ice stand? I told you I cut myself on purpose. With I mean, it looks. Oh, it definitely I'm sorry, looks like that's ice my misunderstanding. I would like to be healed. Sounds like there's no need for If there's healing going, I'll take some healing. I'll right. take his but, uh, healing. But make it clear. <laughs> Heal me twice. <laughs> uh, all right, cure wounds on Prudence. I'm gonna, right. I'm gonna cure wounds so on Prudence. So the, the shard yeah. of ice that was lodged in my arms and upper body, they've all like melted and just left like really clean, but really like deep wounds. Like, ew, 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 ew. <laughs> <laughs> With my eyes closed, I lay on hands and just pinch the wound together. Like that. Yeah. Mm. See, that's how you Love take it. an ice shard squirt. Oh, that's the healing. Fancy, like, you idiot. <laughs> Oh yeah. Can everyone please make me a uh, constitution saving throw? This yes. again. Uh, oh, didn't I? Did I not tell you about my giant coat? It's a 10 now. Uh, 13. It gets cold. <laughs> one. That is a... Oh my god. That's, 16. That's an actual That's a crit one. one. Yeah. Oh no. 12. Oh, wow. So Egbert rolled a critical one. I rolled a critical one. Oh. <laughs> I've taken my coat off because I was so embarrassed about oh, the whole no. thing. I yeah. put it in the back of my bag and now I'm just That shirtless. kind of hypothermia <laughs> where, you, that kind of I, yeah. where you take all your clothes yeah. off. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Egbert's taking it oh, off. Egbert's claiming hypothermia. <laughs> <laughs> I've still got my eyes closed from the healing, so I guess that's why I'm critical wanting. Okay. This isn't going to be good. So you didn't bring a coat. I mean, oh yeah, that. just snowshoes. <laughs> Oh no, the consequences. <laughs> They're here. Um, yeah, you both are starting to feel very, very cold. Um, I you feel warm, I'm so cold. Yeah. You Take your clothes off, it works. Oh, <laughs> join me, in, <laughs> join me oh. in mountain nudity. <laughs> uh, okay, I don't take my clothes off, but I, I don't know if I can do this gently. <laughs> Go on. Let's find out. Can I gently cast heat metal on Egbert's armor? <laughs> uh, that's risky. He's fireproof, right? There's no worst case scenario. I'm fire resistant. Oh, I could melt up all his armor. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but I, might, I just want to make it toasty, you know. Heat, yeah, heat his shield and we can all gather around it and warm ourselves. Yeah. Oh, and, that would be nice. Yeah, and then I'll like lizard onto it and get heat yeah. that way. Or we can just do it to my sword that I have and then we can all... Stabbed. Shield is a big no. in this area. I'm so cold, I demand that Dob does the heat metal thing. Dob! Yes. Heat this armor up. Right. I'm really cold right now. Uh, I cast heat metal on Egbert's How are you armor. Do it Lovely. Gently? I don't know, no, Prudence. Do I. Okay. Uh, levels. So, tell me about heat metal. Uh, choose a manufactured ob metal object. Check. Uh, <laughs> ah. Hmm. It does. Set the words red hot. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Dob, I'm freezing here! Mm. And there, it does also mention fire damage. You're immune to fire, right? Resistant. Resistant. Right. Fire damage is halved. There's Let's go! Heat okay. right. the shield no. on the ground! That's, no, your crit is, you think it's a great idea. Oh. You're cold enough, you're like, okay. yeah, you want to do it. I also think it's a great idea. Oh, Let's no. do this, Dob, right. I don't know why you're hanging out. Unfortunately, around. we think this is a great idea, yeah. so I place both hands <laughs> on Egbert's uh, Before anyone can stop breastplate, no. and I heat it up. Um, as a consequence, <laughs> needless to say, Egbert becomes briefly comfortably warm, uh, <laughs> but, but then takes 2d8 oh. fire damage. So roll 2d8 and spell. then halve it. That's a Doesn't four. matter anymore. No, no. And a four, so four. You take four points. Ow! I cast Cure Wounds on Egbert. <laughs> Fine. Uh, Egbert smells delicious. <laughs> Like Egbert, egg, like you never knew that a dragonborn would mm. smell so good when quickly being, everyone when crowd being around it though because it is still warm. We may as well I'm benefit. I'm warming myself it. on Egbert's flame. <laughs> 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 well done. Mm. Uh, in oh, that case, the next time I think I, that was a good idea. Everyone does get nice and warm. You have a, a nice little break. Um, so bismuth does kind Egbert of sink into the snow. <laughs> <laughs> the bismuth fills a cup from from Frisky's little barrel and passes that around. Yes. Uh, I tell you what, the next time uh, you make. Uh, 
constitution saving throw against the cold, I won't up the difficulty to a 15. It'll stay, <laughs> okay. it'll stay at a 10 because you've just fortified yourselves. Yeah. Well done. Yeah. Very, very good. <laughs> um, is that what that was? Fortifying. Yeah. It didn't feel very fortifying, fortifying to me. Damage. This is great. We've got a permanent solution to the cold. We set Egbert on fire every time we, we get cold. Him. <laughs> we heal him straight back up. We can heal him as fast as we melt him. It's fine. Yeah. I'll, I'll heal with this hand. And <laughs> roast with the hand. <laughs> Roasting and oh, healing. That's how I play Skyrim. Yeah. <laughs> 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 okay, so um, you, are you, I presume you're proceeding sort of up the mountain. Yeah, a bit, mm-hmm. yeah. A bit the only way is up. Yeah. The Guys, terrain. We heard some, we heard some leathern wings. Uh, yeah, nice. I think it might be the dragon. Sweet. But he didn't attack or do anything mean, so okay. maybe he's nice. It's just okay. just some info, mm-hmm. just some intel for you. Thanks guys. for the heads up. Yeah, no worries. Yeah, the hunch you get is that it was it was stirring in its sleep, basically. Yeah. Mm. So it is asleep, and right. we managed to silently kill that stupid ice pterodactyl. Mm. Yeah, that was so. sweet. <laughs> All right. All right, I think my spider climb has probably worn off at, by this stage. We've been climbing okay. for a while. I'm going to have to climb like a norm. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so are you still a giant octopus? No, oh, okay, no, fine. No. Oh, I should have known. There's not a puppet on the table. <laughs> um, fine, you keep moving, and the sort of you do pick up the path again. You, mm. you sort of mm-hmm. uh, pick up the trail. It is getting quite narrow. You're going to have to proceed sort of one by one. Obviously, you know you're still tied together in two groups, so uh, we'll keep it the same order. Prudent cars on mm-hmm. Egbert, mm-hmm. Dog, Meryl one. Um, yeah, as you continue on, could uh, Prudent actually? Could you make me? Mm-hmm. A wisdom perception check, okay, please. Okay, wisdom perception check. That's uh, okay. Cool. All right, that is a, it's a nine. Everyone also back in line. Also, make me a wisdom perception check, please. Sorry, I should have oh. got everyone to do it. You have. Oh no, wait, that's something. Seven. Eighteen minus one. Seventeen. Oh, yeah, sorry. Eight. Uh, f- fifteen. Cool. Oh no, wait, nine. Seventeen. Sorry. Okay. Um, as Prudence sort of, you know, continues walking along and then steps, uh, steps on something, you hear a dry crack. Everyone sort of behind you sort of like looks up and you see uh, there are kind of like some, there's like uh, some stakes driven into the ground, like at an angle to the mountain face. And then there are just rocks piled up oh. here. Okay. And there's, it's quite well hidden against the, the wall, but there is a line kind of going down to roughly where Prudence is standing. Oh my god. Suffice it to say, the stakes come away and the rocks start to tumble down (laughs) toward Prudence, who right now is unaware. (laughs) Oh my god. P.S. Who's who's behind Prudence? I'm behind Prudence. Um, Did you pass the... I did, yeah. You did, okay. What are you going to do? Uh, um, um... (laughs) Who oh is God. aware? Egbert's also aware. I'm definitely aware. Um, Stop the only one who isn't. Oh, I've got a nine, so I guess I'm not. No, you're not. Sweet. What an amazing view. <laughs> it's great, Prudence. <laughs> it does look like an amazing view. We don't, I don't know. We don't get out into nature often enough. Isn't uh, that right, Prudence? Breathe that fresh air. Ah. Bracing. Ten. I can, use, I can use Mage Hand to manipulate Eight. objects. I use Mage Seven. Hand to grab Prudence and pull her backwards towards me. Cool, great. Um, d- that's the, is, there's no kind of role involved in that, is there? Uh, there is not. Okay, cool. I'm going to allow this. I imagine like a claw hand. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay, so yeah, you, you sort of yank Prudence back. Uh, Prince, can you also just make me a an athletic saving throw? Oh, an athletic saving well, throw? Don't, don't do well, that. <laughs> I'm neither, I don't do I'm neither acrobatic nor a, athletic. A strength saving throw, strength then. That's saving just throw. all it is. There we go. And that was a 16, yeah. Okay, uh, yeah. You, you feel the mage hand, and at first you're like, who is magically trying to manipulate me? How dare What the you? hell is going on? And then you're, the, you, you've you sort of become Yoink. sensible to the fact Pluck that it, right. you're about to get cream. So you mm. sort of, you throw yourself willingly back into it. Um, Prudence smacks into Corazon, but manages just about to keep her feet. And there's a, a moment where everyone's like, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Um, the you then sort of pause, and the only sound you hear is sort of your own panicked breathing. Um, your heart beats in your ears. The wind kind of through the peaks, and then the unbelievable crash of all of these boulders going down the mountain. They flatten a couple of trees, um, and you hear uh, an enormous from up the 
the the peak, you just hear this roar, this oh. roar of unmistakably a dragon. Um, Whoops. And again, well, good thing you went under that, Prudence. There's another yeah. pause where you're sort of just like, and you hear sort of a. Oh no, it's the. And then you hear sort of like a. There's just the flump of something hitting the snow. That's the tail. I think. For sure, the tail. I think he might have stirred but gone back to sleep. Or, like, woken up proper. Um, all right, well, why don't we just hang here and listen for another 10 seconds and see if there's okay. any more crumpy, flumpy, roary noises, or if it's, you know, nice silence. All right. Everybody yeah. make me a, uh, a wisdom, check. wisdom perception check for crumpy, flumpy noises. If you have proficiency in crumpy, flumpy, uh, remember crumpy to add that. Oh, damn it. Uh, crumpy, which, crumpy's great for combat, though. 12. 12. 12. 11. 11. Uh, Nine. 15. Four minus one is three. <laughs> I take my mace out and I put my tongue in it to see if it gets stuck. <laughs> and it does get stuck. <laughs> um, okay. I can't I can't keep keep <laughs> <laughs> what did you roll, Marilyn? I got like a nine. Egbert okay. <laughs> so Egbert, Egbert gets his tongue stuck to his mace and it's like. Nye, nye, nye. Oh, um, oh. You, you hear, you are, you can hear Marilyn, you're like, oh God, it's here. It's here. You can hear this bra this dragon breathing. It's been like, and then you realise it's just Egbert with his tongue stuck. <laughs> like, the rest of you were like, okay, I think we're safe. I use prestidigitation to flavour Egbert's mace raspberry. <laughs> mm. <laughs> I was like, a I raspberry stopped trying to remove. Okay, Come on, thank you for. Um saving me from that rock fall. Oh, wow. That's yeah. so nice Appreciate of you to, to say. Yeah, I was well, not expecting... Don't, don't tell anyone I thanked that. you. <laughs> Guys, Brutus just no. thanked me. It was really sweet and nice. Raven! <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Wait, let me... Oh, no. Raven! This is why I don't thank people. Raven! <laughs> Raven! <laughs> Prudence. Oh, that's so Raven. Thanks, Corazon. <laughs> and thinks that he's cool. <laughs> raven, if you could just yeah, I'll I'll give it to the raven. It's just it's a bit them. shy this one. <laughs> yes, it's away. Cool. Can't wait for everyone to find out. All right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Bismuth starts. You sort of like, but you're you're very aware of the fact you're on a tent, like a, mm. a really teetery path on a mountaintop. You're like, God, none of my Bismuth is moving around so much. <laughs> She's going through her little Sherpa yeah. pack, and I'm still. And this my mace, I assume as well. So I only got one. wasn't fine. touching the armor in the heat metal. Red. <laughs> no, it was no, the no, no, no. Bismuth yeah. is fine. You look at Bismuth; she died. <laughs> <laughs> no. Okay, no, so no, no. you round the corner um, and sort of. This mountain is dangerous, guys. There's traps everywhere. We need to yeah. have our wits about us. Yeah. So sort of, no one go marching ahead anymore. Who's good at detecting traps? I, feel I mean, like I, I, I am. Well, um, Corazon, be my guest, please. Right. Okay. Well, fine. I will go ahead, but very. I'll be very cautious. Take point. I'm going, go, I'm going to go ahead. Okay, all right. We'll swap positions with Prudence. Right. Okay. We should keep up a reasonable pace because I feel like blood flows. Yeah, but also mm -hmm. we need to. We can't make any more noise. We're going to wake up that dragon. Oh yeah, quietly. Um, oh yeah. Night is starting to close in. Oh, by man. the way, and you're like, oh, we're very oh. much on the mountain. Oh, but, um, I need to base camp. Cave. Base camp. Do you want a camp? A cave. For the night. Or yeah. there's no time limit on this, right? Well, we're having to make hits camp for constitution years. checks. Yeah. We're getting colder. Get but if we scale, camp, yeah. we'll be in. I mean, we can we can get we've, all got, we've all got bed rolls. We're going to fire yeah. going. Yeah, we, we need know. to warm up. If, I think everyone is yeah slowly coming around to the idea that it might be wise to find somewhere to camp soon. Cool. Um, I can tell some stories of my past adventures. <laughs> Let's not camp. <laughs> the um, the <laughs> path you're on. Outside. <laughs> the path you're on is is kind of there's a sudden incline and it sort of twists up like mm. whoop, a real like bend. And then it seems to plateau out a bit. It seems like um, a good place to make Could you guys. all just make me either a strength athletics check or a dex acrobatics check, yes. please? In order to get up this, um, this oh. Oh. incline. Nat 20. Crit, 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 crit. I got a 19. Okay. Uh, strength, I got 15 plus 4 mm -hmm. is 19. 12. So I rolled only a six, but I do have like tons of dexterity and acrobatics. You've, so. I mean, yeah, What's you were looking, uh, you were just looking to beat a ten. So oh yeah, yeah, we're good. yeah okay, we're fine. Okay. So everyone sort of makes it up. Um, Corazon sort of like, uh, sort of like runs up, hmm. kind of gallantly. It's like, nah, nah. and yeah, 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 everyone, everyone. <laughs> no, it's no, like a, does a okay, heroic cool. pose right. on the. Yeah. <laughs> we're all like, the, <laughs> the the wind kind of like whoosh, through his hair, <laughs> begrudgingly. You are all like. Um, you sort of emerge onto a plateau 
where there are some trees that give like decent coverage. Um, there's a nice clearing, and then there's a sheer rock face that sort of overhangs slightly. This looks like a perfect Ooh. place oh, to pitch a camp. Mm. Great. Um, mm. Would you like to check it for traps first? Well, I mean, yes. of course. Don't be wise. Okay. <laughs> um, we'll call this an intelligence, invest intelligence investigation check to really check out the area. Okay. Can I use detect magic as well in case there's yes. magic Yes, you can. Am I able to have a look around, sir? Yeah. Yeah, anyone who wants to can have a, have a, have All a right. look. All right. 14. 14. 17. Uh, 17. 19. 17. Okay. 20, no, 20. Wow. 18. All right. Three. Um, <laughs> Minus one. I licked your mace. Apricot. Having just removed mace, I then lick it again and see whether it's part of his tongue. Whether it's changed yeah. flavour. Yeah. Has it? Yeah, now it's vanilla. Oh, oh it's a nice. nice cup though. <laughs> One more lick and it'll be chocolate. Yeah. It's the Neapolitan thing. Anyway, um, it's, you know what, it's, it's actually, it is quite well disguised, but like either there's been recent snowfall and it's kind of made it sag a bit, but there is a definite indent where it seems like there's basically there's a pit. Um, with oh. sort of branches laid over the top and it's a snows. It's a punchy pit. It's, it's a, yeah, it's a punchy pit, basically. And everyone's like, there's the punchy pit. Classic. Um, no one roll into it in their sleep. Egg, but roll into it in your sleep. <laughs> um, are the punchies wood? Can we use them for a fire? Make it into a fire pit. Yeah. Or, yeah. Or, 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 or pluck them all out, stick them in, and like make little defences around our camp. Oh, fortify the perimeter. Yeah. You used yeah. Also, magic, didn't you? I did use the set magic. Um, you spot this pit because it is faintly glowing, sort of oh. a dark, swirling purple and black. There, there is some it. form of magic placed on this pit where you're like, this is... What's the deal with oh. the pit, Bruins? The trap, it, it has a, an aura, a, a black aura mm. of oh. magic. This is no ordinary pit. All right, pit. I say we throw a blanket over it and ignore it. No, we should, di we should disassemble it. Oh, Look okay. The, can we take the cover, the cover of branches off and see yes. what's in it? It is fairly deep, and there are sort of just a bunch of yeah, as you would expect, a bunch of sharpened Sharp sticks. sticks. You're looking at it like with you know with your with your normal eyes, and you're like, this is just a pit. Why yeah. is there an, some form of yeah, magical? Yeah, it doesn't take magic to put it. some pointy sticks in the ground. But there Maybe is still magic. no. You're looking at it. It's it's almost like the the pit has a foot of standing water in it, but it's just weird magical oh. swirling energy, and you're like, oh, ah, you're like, I don't know. It's almost like you've caught a tune from like two doors down. You're like, I don't know what this is, mm. but it's kind of my jam. But I don't know. What, mm. ah. Like, it's like whoever did this is like, like they're one of my people. Like they, mm. 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 but also wh why? You don't really get it. Okay, all right. Theory: we... A warlock fell in it. Well, I know to set this trap off. So it's it's been laid by someone who. So one of my people, I fit some in some way. Well, I admire the craftsmanship okay. and identify with the, the maker of this trap. Well, should we get these stakes out and build a fire with them? Yeah, we should neutralize the trap if we're gonna. If we're okay, gonna I'm gonna power. try and pull a pull a stake out and see if it comes out. Okay. Does it? Um, yeah, I'm just make me a little strength athletics check to see if you can. Uh, eighteen. Yeah. Cool. Like um. Coruscant's like, hold my rope, and sort of leans out <laughs> over the thing and just whoop, yeah. pulls the stake up. Seems fine. Yeah. All right, well, I'm going to put this down in the middle of where we're going to camp. And this can be, we can set fire to it and it'll be a nice fire. It's sort of like, as it goes down to the snow, it's still kind of like swirling with yeah. energy, but you feel it's starting to dissipate. Now it's been separated from the rest of the trap. Okay. So yes, you have pulled out a stake from the, the punji pit or punji right. pit or however you say. Uh, I'm going to use my tinder box to get this thing on fire. I guess um, I'll get the rest of the stakes out for cool. perimeter stake. Yeah, just situation. make me a strength athletics check just to determine sort of how long it takes you. And how it's critical it. one, Johnny. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Oh, oh dear. No. Oh dear. Egbert falls in the trap. <gasps> Egbert? <laughs> uh, Why did I fall in the trap? <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, not Egbert. Dob. <laughs> Dob. Just, just, just muscle memory. <laughs> yeah, sorry, man. Right, just Dob. Habit. Just unrelated. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to say, is this Dobbs punishment? That's how badly you rolled. <laughs> okay, all right, so I've fallen into... You fall in the trap, it oh. skews yeah. you in the oh, pit. God. You take five points of damage. Oh. 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 Don't move! Don't all right. move it work. Oh. I jump in the trap to get no. rolled out. No. Oh. All right. Uh, God bless you, Egbert, sweet Egbert. <laughs> make me a 
I mean, this would be dex acrobatics, I think, to avoid falling on spikes. Yeah. Okay. Just make me a dex acrobatics check. Okay. I've got athletics, but not acrobatics. Yeah. Um, uh, oh, Ooh, 19 <laughs> plus two. Hey. Um, but kind of like, even though you're bleeding a lot, uh, you can see that it's kind of cool that he basically, he sort of like huh, leaps into the pit. He bounces one of his feet off a, mm. a stake and uses it as a kick turn, and he lands in the, the spot where one of them had been removed. Cool. Yeah. And I've still got the mace in my mouth. Yeah, that, 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 I got you, buddy. <laughs> hey, Egbert. Hey. Well, thanks for jumping in, man. That's appreciated. All right. I don't know if I should take it out or leave it in. <laughs> <laughs> What's, uh, <laughs> I'm not going to be much help in this situation. <laughs> Can I just pull uh, Dob and the stake out at the same time? Yeah, strength athletics, please. Okay. <laughs> 16 plus 4 is 20. You manage it. And you're sort of like, you, uh, you get both of them out. Yeah. He's quite near the edge because he was sort of leaning in yeah. and then just kind of. Oh, Dob. Um, so dog, you put dog, him, dog. You, you basically yeah. you hoist him I'll out. I'll get him pit. back up. Yeah. Um, uh, I walk over and say, well, guys, I got the fire stuff. Oh my god! <laughs> what the hell happened here? Corazon, sweet Corazon. You've always been a kind to me. What's no, wait, no, you haven't. Give <laughs> <laughs> me a real joke. Stop, stop. Yeah? Stop. Yes, Prudence. Does it feel magic? Uh, <laughs> you know, it does. Yeah. It's a sort of tingling sensation. Yeah. Sort of uh, lightheaded feeling. <laughs> you, you know what? Maybe while I'm feeling the painful magic yeah. in my, deep in my flank, uh -huh. uh, maybe I could try and put it into music. Maybe you'll recognise the tune. Okay. Let's do some sensory association. Okay. Uh, if I had. To ah! <laughs> if I had to, to describe the music, I guess it Man would be God like. dedicated. No, that is no. too, too tuneful. Okay. Okay. Uh, Ringing any bells? It's sick in my side. It hurts real bad. I might have died. <laughs> Did that stir any memories? No. Oh. Oh. Sorry. Oh, that's fine. It was worth trying. <laughs> <laughs> Would you like me to extract this this pointy? Stick? I would like someone to do something. <laughs> All right, well let's do this then. I plant one foot on Wait, Dob. It might be easier if we push it through to the other side. <laughs> yeah. No, because it's pointy. You it's... guys know best. <laughs> Bismuth goes. Somebody, well, <laughs> <stop." laughs> um, no Bismuth. Not now, not the time. <laughs> Okay, you gotta you gotta pull out. We got, I gotta yank it out. We can't leave it in there. Yeah. All right. All his bags come out at the same time. Down by his shoulders. I give him a magic. stick to bite Dog's down onto. Magic. All right. I'm ready to I'm ready to compress the wound once the stake is out. Staunch it. Yeah. yeah. Am so. I allowed to cure wounds again? Am I allowed to? Do I need to rest or anything? Even, I mean, uh, spell slots need to be exhausted to do cure wounds. I see. I mean, I've done it loads. <laughs> <laughs> I'm right. gonna, I'm gonna go for a cure wounds thing. Let's All get right. it out. Let's get I'm it out. I'm gonna plant a foot on Dob. Vision yep. tunneling. Mm. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna yank this this pointy stick out of the f Dob's flank. You yep. do you, magic prudence. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be okay, Dob. I feel warm it's now. Be good. Job. What do you see? <laughs> I see a cow? No, that can't be true. Oh, welcome to my crew! So warm. Finally, someone believes me. Alright, I'm gonna yank and then someone's gonna heal. Yeah. Alright, I'm ready to heal. I'm right, holding yanking. him down All so right, he can't move. I'm the stichectomy. Inspiration. Uh, I jam my hands yeah. in the hole. Pressure on this. And cure wounds. Alright, so yeah, it's in sort of a deft movement. Uh, Prudence kind of pulls out. The stake and kind of like uh, rears back with it, looking pretty cool. You you cure the the wounds, um, and yeah, Dob, as you sort of like you start to feel better, but you do hear a distant like. Um, hey, but you're filled with sort of a warm, suffusing mm. sense of well-being. That might be blood. Like <laughs> <laughs> it is. You're like. Oh, one of my buddies. La Lavash Mauve noticed that. Yeah. And that was good. Like that. Ooh, a totem points. That was a little step on the old, oh. the old totem yes. part. That was. You're welcome. Um, <laughs> Prudence, <little trick. laughs> you sort of like, like, hup, you huck away the, the, the steak and you look at, you know, you look down at Dom and be like, ah, a job well done. Mm. Like, hmm. you see under the skin uh, from Dom, you see sort of like, there's some purple energy mm. sort of rising there. You notice from the steak. <laughs> And as you watch, it doesn't seem to dissipate, it just seems to... Tunnels into his brain. <laughs> it disappears into Dob. Oh, oh. Fab. Dob, 
great news. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Prudence. How do you feel about things tunnelling into you? <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, ambivalent. There may, there may have been a magical residue from the pointy stick that is now... How do I say? What's the medical term? Inside you. <laughs> <laughs> I see. Um, so let's see how that goes. My, my detect magic is focused on, on Dob right now. I'm reading his aura. How does he look? Um, he seems almost normal. Like oh. if you hadn't seen this energy go into him, oh. you wouldn't even have noticed. Oh. It, right now it's Barely touched the sides. Yeah. <laughs> and great news, guys. I successfully got the stake. Yeah. <laughs> so. Can we have uh, one outing where you don't get something burrowing into you? <laughs> <laughs> I, I have one rule, Corazon. Something must burrow in. Um, let's keep an eye on it because um, I, I like it. I'm <laughs> dead. I, I wish I were you. <laughs> well, I, okay. I managed to. St- Pull a steak out and start a fire, so everyone gather round, warm yourselves, I make right. some have some hard fresh tack. herb tea. Okay, I, I, I place the, the one tea. I place the one Sounds steak gross. that I got as a defense. <laughs> 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 it sort of points outwards like Great that. Great work. That ought to show. Bismuth uh, pitches the tent. The tent looks like a mausoleum. Amazing. <laughs> Love what you've done with the place. <laughs> she, she's, she's. Managed to find a broom somewhere and she's sort of sweeping. I feel momentarily bad that we got the old lady to put the tent up while um, we were mucking about. She's, she's, she's making busy. <laughs> um, you can sort of hear uh, Frisky in the darkness kind of just gallivanting off in the woods. They've, they've, they figure you're going to stop for the night. Mm. It is getting dark. All right, should we take, a, take turns having take a watch? watch. Yeah. Take, yeah, I would love to. Why don't we all just sleep? Because somebody because might something come might come up. All right, I can take here. first watch. I use disguise self to make myself look like a gun turret. <laughs> 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 Sweet, like a ballista. <laughs> like an automated ballista. Sure. Like an automated you killed Johnny. Oh no, of you killed Johnny. With guns not <laughs> existing in here, it won't really <laughs> scare anyone. I think you can have inspiration Hooray. for really killing me. Hooray. Okay, so everyone else turns in. Garazan, you... Um, Turn into what? <laughs> it's, uh, everyone goes to bed for the night. Um, in your in your bed rolls in the tent, like, it's... It's cramped, but it's you. If anything, you're glad of the warmth. Uh, Corazon, can you uh, make me a Constitution check, please? Um, you're going to beat a town again. Oh, it's a five. Okay, you stay awake for a couple of hours. Okay. Um, but um, you don't. You eventually you nod off at your post. Boring. I'm going to sleep. My... <laughs> <laughs> you deliberately nod off your uh, your post out of boredom. I'm not asleep. I. I'm in a trance. Oh, you are in a trance. Four hours. Okay. Um, so fine. About two hours after he falls asleep, I would wake up. Okay, fine. Could you make me a uh, wisdom perception check, please? I thought it was the one, but it's not. It's fine. Uh, 11, 14. Okay. The night continues to pass. Oh, did we not set up like a, a, a watch yeah, I was, yeah, we, I, I'm assuming we did. Yes. You said, I'll take it, first watch. Oh, yeah, we all Corazon would have to be awake to come and... <laughs> After yeah, four you would hours, you, you come out of your trance mm-hmm. and you're like, yeah, it's probably time to go relieve Corazon mm-hmm. of his duty. Mm-hmm. And then I see him asleep and I kick him. That <laughs> killed my father! What? You, what? You are? <laughs> what? I'm not your father. <laughs> 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 No. We, you, you see anything on watch? Uh, yeah, there was a whole band of goblins, um, and they came up and they were like, "Er, gonna kill everyone." And I was like, "Don't even try it, mate." And they were like, "Fair dues," and they left. So it was very brave, cool, and cool of me. And, yeah. um, but apart from that, nothing, nothing else to report. Okay. Do yeah. you wanna, do you go back to sleep in the tent? I'll what take you mean over. Back to sleep. For, to sleep for the first time? I will. Yes, I will go to sleep for the first yeah. time. In the tent. Wisdom perception check, please, Coruscant, as you stand up. Right, stand up easily and roll a critical one. <laughs> <laughs> you step off the cliff. Oh, <laughs> Your feet are falling off. The yeah. <laughs> you see a bear off in the forest. You're like, there's a bear! I see a bear! Marwan, there's a bear in the forest. Oh, where? Over there in the forest. Okay. I look in the direction that Coruscant is pointing. It's nothing. Merwin, do something about the bear! Turn into a bear and fight it, or marry it, or something. <laughs> if it's fine, it's going the other way, Corazon. You just go to sleep. Right. 
Okay. Watch out for those goblins, they might be back. They yeah, were real. I will. The main thing about them the is how real they were. <laughs> yes. All right, I'm going to bed now. Go to bed. Okay. Good. Go dream about ships. Good. Yeah, I will. Huh? All right, I go back to the <laughs> tents and dream about ships. You dream about ships. Okay. Yeah. Um, mm. Metalware, make mm-hmm. me another wisdom perception check, please. 16. Um, sort of after Coruscant goes, you're like, oof, silly. And then you sort of, you look off into the direction uh, where he claimed to have seen a bear, and you notice that there are some footprints that have come out of the wood, and they sort of of stand up, you you follow them with your eyes, and they lead, right, they lead straight around the pit, and they end right next to the tent. And then they just lead off again into the forest. I shake Dom awake. We're being bear witched! <laughs> okay. Dom, Dom, are you, okay? are you okay? Are you okay? Yes, thanks for asking. Um, Why'd you wake me up just to ask about that? Did you wake back to sleep? <laughs> hey, it's fine, go to bed. It's fine. Oh, uh, no, um, um, how good, how good are you at tracking? Incredibly. Oh, yeah, good. Um, incredibly uh, confident at tracking. Uh, yeah, um, I just need a fellow. Tracker, maybe yeah, or okay. someone to kind of keep an eye on things. Ah, for this footprint situation. Hey, you guys. Hey, Prudence. Guys, um, I haven't even fallen asleep yet. I haven't had my okay. tight eight hours. What's it's going on? It's nobody's <laughs> fault. I'm thinking about ships, but not asleep and dreaming about ships. Mm-hmm. There may have been a watch keeping malfunction. Mm-hmm. Meryl when? <laughs> <laughs> it was. Uh, certainly discovered on Meryl Wen's watch. <laughs> Meryl so Wen. really, it's Meryl Wen's fault. <laughs> what, what, what did you discover, Meryl Wen? There's some footprints. Oh my God! Coming out from where Corazon claimed he saw so a negligent. bear. Yeah, okay. and you didn't believe me, did you? And well. they came up towards the camp, circled the pit, mm. had a little look at the pit, and, and then went, came to the tent, and then went off again. What kind All of right. tracks? Footprints. Who's got food in their pockets? Bears can smell food. It's oh. not bear prints, Corazon. It was Foot- footprints. What, human, human footprints? Yes. I drop down to the floor and start okay. sniffing the footprints to get a scent. Oh, I, 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 um, I send my pet babies, my, yeah. uh, my dire grimoires after the, the scent as well. Yeah. Uh, they don't have noses, but and I, I feel like they'd enjoy it. I produce oh. a magnifying glass and look at the footprints. Yeah. Um, I'm still asleep. Okay. <laughs> okay. With the mace stuck to your tongue. Yeah. Roll me wisdom survival. Yeah, okay. Cut the scent. Well. Well. Uh, mm. <laughs> Nine. <laughs> <laughs> I could use inspiration and roll again. Could Do use it. that to Do not it. fall in the pit. Do it. Um, <laughs> Do it. Oh, yeah, you no, you can't. It, I, oh, yeah. yeah I, All right. Yeah, I, I use inspiration. I'm going to do that one again. Okay. Three. <laughs> oh my! You do not pick up the scent, Dobbed possibly it. because uh, there are two like grimoires, so okay. just hopping around you and occasionally licking your face with raspy, raspy tongues. Guys, I think what we're tracking is some kind of snow. <laughs> <laughs> a snow came in here. Snowman. Oh. A snow, a snowman, or snowmen. <laughs> uh, um, you can roll me wisdom survival, also Coruscant to, to try and follow the footprints. Okay. Oh, that should have. <laughs> 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 that is it. That's a critical one. Get this dice. <laughs> this dice is, is bad. Broken. This dice is broken, does, I think. Does Bismuth have any ravens left? She I doesn't mean, know. I mean, I've been in pretty constant contact with my estate agent. Uh, Coruscant, yes. you run into a tree. You're, oh. like, you're like, follow me! Uh, you, he's like, head down, sprints. I follow Corazon. Ow. Smashes into a tree. Um, you can make me an acrobatic saving throw. Uh, uh, what am I trying to beat? It's a tree. Call it a ten. Yeah, we're good. Okay. Oh, no! That is... <laughs> Six points. <laughs> oh, wow. You really just wow. Heck Those it. trees are mean. You huh? run so hard I, into this tree. I Ooh. run in with a tree once. I totally understand you. Ah, uh, how? That's what you get for trying to chop the one earlier. Well, I've rested briefly, so yes, yeah, so everyone wounds, has had a Corazon. I had a rest. Yeah. Oh, thank you. You're welks. <laughs> okay. <laughs> You've tried to sniff the footprints, <laughs> and you've tried to follow the footprints. Have we tried to taste them, though? <laughs> Have we tried to befriend uh, the footprints? <laughs> Speak to any... the footprints. Hmm? <gasps> oh my goodness, I go up to the tree that oh, Corazon just ran up into, and I cast Speak with Plants. <laughs> Ask it to apologise. 
to me. Okay, yeah, you can't speak with plants. <clears throat> good after, no, good morning. Hello, it's I'm the really yellow. sorry about my friend running into you. Are you okay? I am absolutely fine. Ask him to apologize to me. My roots go thick. Yeah. As thick as your friend appears to be. <laughs> Ha, ha. Really good joke. Tree I'll joke. I'll explain later. Yeah, um, I was just wondering. What's my favourite part of a dog? The bark. Yes. <laughs> I thought he was going to say the bark. <laughs> oh. 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 I'm sorry. I'm not. All right, guys. Yeah, Everyone's right, yeah. going to be busy for several hours talking to um, this friggin' tree. So how about we strike out as a new team? Um, mm. I was just wondering. You're still bleeding and stuff. Like <laughs> Did you see? Did you happen to see who left these footprints? Up to a point, yes. Yes. Could you give me a vague? <laughs> not having eyes, probably. Description. <laughs> I... Please give me a vague description. <laughs> <laughs> as vague as you can. He is well known to us in the last few months in the forest. Mm -hmm. He comes, he sets the traps, he leaves. The trapper. No, I just say that randomly. A while ago, he murdered some of my friends. <gasps> and turned them into some form of cabin. It is um, a short walk up this hill. Okay. Probably. Okay. Oh my gosh. I don't understand relative movement. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, um, are you all okay though? After my friend ran into you, you're fine. You're Absolutely fine. You're fine. <laughs> Good. There Good. is one thing I would ask of you in I'm fine return if for this favor that I have done. Yeah. There is a woodpecker. Yeah. He lives in my branches. Yeah. He pecks me to hide the acorns in my bark. Yeah. In my bark. In my bark. <laughs> <laughs> Don't give up. Please kill it for me. I, well, I'll, I'll ask him to vacate. Unacceptable. I demand you kill the woodpecker. Meryl, what's okay. he saying? Um, he wants us to get rid of this woodpecker. I find something. my crossbow at the woodpecker. <laughs> <laughs> it's really, yeah, there's a woodpecker that's like, it's, its ears are burning. It's like, uh, uh, uh. Uh, yeah, fire, fire crossbow. That's a, it's, <laughs> the armor glass of a woodpecker. It's a dex. Is this not just gonna like pin it into the tree? <laughs> oh no! Uh, twelve. Oh. <laughs> you pin a Nailing. woodpecker into the tree. Oh. <laughs> Done. Ah, ha, 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 ha. Oh, amazing. <laughs> the woodpecker belongs to the tree. Okay, I'm, I'm glad you enjoyed that. So um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Thanks, Corazon. You're that. welcome. It's he great. sort of lowers a branch and like tries to pat you reassuringly. He's just like whoosh. Uh, thanks. Whoosh. That, yeah, thanks. I really, <laughs> I, I really appreciate that. True thanks. friend of the thank forest. Thank you, thank you. We'll go up and we'll try and find out. Uh, about this guy that hurt your friends. Cool. Right. Yeah. So you have to... I, I have nothing to ask. Okay. I want to ask you something, Merylwen. Not right. okay. I roast the woodpecker and eat it. There, Merylwen. Are you happy? <laughs> I mean, at least you're using it. It's yeah. fine. Um, <laughs> at least it's not gone to waste. Nice. Um, yeah. Uh, we'll we'll leave you to it. Uh, do, do, do you want any mulch or anything? <laughs> anything extra? <laughs> Do you want any more? That is an intensely personal <laughs> question. Oh, that's right. Oh, no, 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 Do we that's have mulch? Dude, that's <laughs> you didn't bring mulch? We did like, mulch. You've never seen a tree stare like pointedly ahead before. But <laughs> 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 okay, we were just, just, just if you want to like... Have a nice afternoon. <laughs> okay, thanks. It's just because we've got all this wood here, so... The, the, okay, bye, bye. I assume that conversation went really well. Yeah, it went you really were charming well. And he was charming. Um, yeah, and what did great. you learn? Um, did you trees really don't like woodpeckers. Okay. Uh, and uh, was that the key bit of information you garnered? Um, <laughs> well, it's the bit that's sticking in my mind right now. Um, also, there is a cabin <laughs> up the okay. way well. that we should head towards, and ball. there's a guy that's been uh, cutting down. Footprints man. Yeah, I think I think it's the footprints man or person, um, and uh, it's it's. It's, uh, you know, probably the person who made the trap and left it. Okay, well if it means we're going to get off this friggin' mountain, I think we should head up and find this cabin and put an end to this jerk and his Wait, deeds. wait, 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 wait. Isn't it like two in the morning? Can we not go back to sleep? Well, yeah, obviously we'll do it in the morning. 
All I right. think the sun yeah. has sort of been slowly coming up. All right. Element well, of surprise. As well. If anyone wants a fillet of woodpecker, I'm frying it up right now. No, I'm going to have another hour's sleep. Give me a wing. Says Bismuth. You go, Bismuth. I got some buffalo sauce for her. She eats it. She cracks the bone. She starts eating the marrow. Nice. What will our heroes find in the cabin? Can they stop the great evil? And can you believe how rude Merylwen was to that tree? Come on back tomorrow for the next exciting episode on Outside Extra, and subscribe so you never miss any of the Oxventure. <laughs>